What's going on guys? It's your boy CMB back in the building back with another video Don't forget to subscribe to the channel Now let's get into this one really quickly guys So you guys know the big fights coming up in November guys uh, November 6th to be exact I'm talking about the undisputed matchup of course uh, Canelo Alvarez who is the face of boxing versus Caleb Sweethands Plant, who is the IBF super middleweight champion. You guys know Canelo Alvarez is already a, a unified champion. Uh, he holds the WBC, WBA, and uh, WBO titles. He scooped those up fighting Callum Smith and Billy Joe Saunders. And he picked up the WBC, it was vacated at the time uh, by David Benavidez because of the situation where he, uh, I think he, no, he uh, he missed weight on the scale. He had another situation before where he lost the title uh, because of the cocaine situation, but the last time he lost it because uh, he didn't make weight on the scale. But uh, like I said, he's a unified champion, of course. Now, I saw the video, uh, the little interview on Fight Hype, and it was questioning Canelo Alvarez about facing, you know, other fighters on the PBC. Uh, for those of you who don't know, Canelo Alvarez is a free agent. And honestly, I think him becoming a free agent was the best thing for him. Uh, he, he seems to be fighting a lot more uh, since he became a free agent, uh, sharpening up his skills, uh, doing what he wants to do. I think that's the beauty of being a free agent you know you can fight on the zone uh you can go over fight on the pbc fight on top rank fight ever, wherever you want uh but a lot of you guys know out there the big fights uh that people want to see canelo alvarez uh in there's a lot of fighters on the pbc side uh jamal charlo is one of them of course david benavidez and there's talks of him of Errol Spence Jr. while wanting to face uh, Canelo Alvarez. I think these are all big fights for Canelo Alvarez. And a lot of times we get caught up, a lot of people think that Canelo Alvarez is afraid to face these guys. I really don't think Canelo Alvarez is afraid to face any of these guys. I think it's more of a timing thing with him. And if he's able to uh, get past uh, Caleb Plant in this next fight, uh, I wouldn't be surprised if he fights one of these other fighters uh, in his next fight. Uh, I would think the front runner between those three guys, I, I would say would be Jamal Charlo, in, in my opinion. Uh, a lot of people have been wanting that fight. And I will say Jamal Charlo in the last fight he had, he looked a little bit vulnerable to me. Uh, I don't know if it was because of ring rust. Uh, he just looked, you know, he didn't look like himself in that fight. But I, I think if he did get a Canelo fight, and he's always said he's going to get that fight. I, I think he would be a lot more prepared for that fight. I think that would be a huge fight. It would make a whole lot of money. And it's it, it would definitely put butts in the seats. And I, I think that would be good for boxing in general. Uh, I think it's great that Canelo Alvarez is going to be back on Showtime on a pay-per-view and just get a lot more eyes on him, in my opinion. You know, being this uh, a network uh, as opposed to the zone, uh, being an app, I, I think it, it increases his star power. And I'm, 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 I'm really excited to see the buildup that's going on uh, leading up to the fight that he's gonna fight in. But yeah, guys, I think him fighting those fighters at the PBC, I, I think that would be awesome. Uh, I never really thought Canelo was afraid to face these guys. Uh, like I said, it's all about timing. And I think the time is right now. Not saying that, you know, he's going to beat Caleb Plant. You know, I never put the cart before the horse. I, I'm the one that never wants to underestimate my opponent. Uh, I know a lot of guys out there, a lot of Canelo fans uh, have been winning this fight already. But you can never, you just never know, guys. That's, that's why there's a fight. You just never know what's going to happen in the fight. You know, you can speculate. You can cheer for your favorite guy. But, you know, sometimes things turn out a lot differently than you expected. But, yeah, guys, uh, tell me what you think. Do you think uh, Canelo Alvarez should, if he does get past Caleb Plant, if he does become undisputed at 168 pounds, should he face off against uh, one of these other PBC fighters, Jamal Charlo, David Benavidez, 
uh, even Earl the True Spence Jr. Uh, let me know in the comment section. And also let me know which one you think he should go after first uh, out of those three. It's the CMB. I'll talk to you guys in the next one. And I'm out. Peace.